Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to make a working morph. This is actually one of the basics on how to use Roblox Studio, so let's just get into it. So the first thing we are going to do is go to the link in the description. Let me give it a like and favorite. <laughs> so go to the link in description and you're going to come up to this model. You're going to click the get button and click get now. It's solely free, so you guys don't have to worry about that. Once you have the morph, you're going to go back to Roblox Studio. Once you're back to Roblox Studio, you're going to go to Model, uh, Model, actually no, View. You're going to go to Toolbox, and in Toolbox, you're going to get Roblox Morph, the morph we just got, and you're going to drag it into the workspace. After you have the workspace model right here, what you're going to do is get your other model. So for this case right now, I don't really have the other model. So I'll just get the other model right here. You're going to just get it from anywhere. You can get it from Toolbox. So I'm going to use Starcode real quick. He's a YouTuber for people who don't know. Okay, uh, now you have this right here. Now what you're going to do is uh, go to our morph, the main model right here. You're going to delete the dummy. After you've deleted the dummy, you're going to go into this model right here, our model which we want to change into. You're going to go down here. And what you're going to do is select the humanoid root part and make sure it's not anchored. So if I go to model, as you can see, it's anchored. So we just unanchor it. So for people who don't know what this does, when you anchor humanoid root part, you won't be able to move. Which means that now you'll be stuck in one place. So what now what we're going to do is just move it right here into the correct position. And you could also scale the pad if you like. Now that that is scaled, now that's scaled. Now what you can do is just go into our model in the explorer and put it inside the morph now this whole thing is a single model that means if we move this they both are gonna move because previously if we just selected each of them it look like this but now this is a single model so now this is a single model we know that now what you're gonna do is go to our pad script and you're going to rename this quotation mark. You see this quotation mark? You're going to replace this with the name of your model. So what I'm going to do is keep this uh, easier name. So more main. There you go. Now you're going to change this dummy into the morph's name. So I could name it morph main. There you go. And now I'll just close the script. Uh, you don't have to mess with anything else in the script. So now this morph is pretty much ready. But now you guys might be wondering you want to change how fast or low jumps and everything is. What you can do is go to your model, the mo main model we want to morph into. And now what you're going to do is just scroll down until you find humanoid right here. There you go, humanoid. And now you're going to just come down here and you could just do whatever you like right here. So uh, what if I want to change jump power? I could set this to 10. So now I won't be able to jump much, but I will be able to jump. So now what you can do is just uh, come down here and you could select how fast you can walk. So I'm going to set that to 10. So that will be kind of like how piggy walks, I guess. So uh, that's all. And now when we just play, we're going to go to play here so that we won't be spawned all the way over across the map. So now that we spawn, there you go. Now we just touch the move pad and we will become pre-craft. There you go. Now, as you can see, the animation and stuff isn't here right now. What you can do is add animation into this, but that I'm going to add it into the next video. And as you can see, you can't jump much as well. As you can see, you are jumping, but you can't jump much. So uh, that's it. Thanks for watching this video. 
make sure you like subscribe share because Creecraft said that and also <laughs> subscribe to Creecraft and I guess I'm gonna see you in my next one bye